cut the apple in half. Actually, you can make two models for one apple. And the area where the seeds are is going to be the inner core, but we're going to cut out a little bit larger area. We're going to cut out the area that's going to be the outer core. So you want to trim out very carefully an area that's about, it's like bigger than a quarter. Like if you put a US quarter in there, that would be, would fit in there, even a little bit larger than that. Maybe something like that. I'll do the other one too. So our inner core is going to sit inside here. The inner core is going to be smaller. Now, of course, the outer core is, when I say liquid, it's not like running water, but it is more fluid than the inner core, we think. Now, for the outer core, we're going to use something creamy, not too liquidy. It has to kind of hold the inner core in. So I thought peanut butter was probably a good choice. I have some kind of uh, runny peanut butter. It's an all natural. And we'll put the liquid core in there and then the inner core or carrot is going to kind of just sit in the middle there. The peanut butter will be sticky enough to keep the inner core in place. And if you don't like peanut butter, if you can't eat it, you can use almond butter or cashew butter or something else. Maybe you have something else around the house that you'd like to use. And if you don't like carrots, you can figure out something to replace that with too. Okay. So we are ready for our inner core. You need a carrot that is about the correct diameter somewhere in the middle. So, let's say a piece like this, this might be a little bit too small. So, I'm going to try a few other chunks here. Let's see, about like that maybe. Okay, this is going to be my inner cord. I just push that in like that. So now I have a solid inner core, a liquid outer core, and then the white represents the mantle, and the skin represents the crust. And the amazing thing about this model is that it's approximately to scale. If you could look at the actual earth, we think that the crust would look about like the skin looks on an apple. That's how thin the Earth's crust is compared to the size of the Earth. So let's see, I'll put in another. And then if you want this to stay white for a while, if you want your model to not go brown, you can always rub a little lemon juice on the white part and that'll keep it looking nice and white for a while. 